Hello, I'm Zaki Rashid with this week's Matters of Opinion. ABC World News is airing a reality-based series called Made in America. The reality is that Americans don't buy many USA-made products anymore, and we are therefore partly responsible for the loss of jobs in America. One of the episodes featured a family that couldn't find a single item in their house that was manufactured in the United States. To really bring home the point, the family takes a day trip while movers are brought in to rid the house of all foreign-made items. At the end of the day, the family returns home to an almost empty house, where they are amazed and ashamed by how little thought they gave to buying things made in America. The truth is that most most of us don't think about it. In 1960, foreign goods made up just 8% of Americans' purchases. Today, nearly 60% of everything we buy is made overseas. How we got to this point is not an easy question to answer. But why is it that when we start talking about a war somewhere, everybody gets all patriotic and will fight to the death? But at the same time, we don't give a thought about being patriotic about how we spend our money. How do you think all these other countries' economies are growing? If you don't know, let me give you a little hint. With our money. Manufacturing employment in the United States peaked in 1979, but has been on a downward spiral ever since. If we could spend a little bit more on products to keep U.S. factories open and fellow Americans employed and paying taxes, it seems like a much better deal to me than buying cheaper foreign products. We have to adopt an attitude that places value and patriotism on supporting and spending our money wherever we can on products that are made in the United States. Take the time to look for products that are made in the USA and buy them. In my opinion, national pride has to mean more than just waving a flag and reciting the Pledge of Allegiance. National pride should also mean that we take care of our own first. Well, that's my opinion. What's yours? Email me at zrashid at villagetv.org. You can view this segment again on YouTube by entering Z.A. Rashid in the search box. And we are now on Facebook as well. I'm Zaki Rashid with Matters of Opinion.